Electric vehicles, EVs, are often touted as cleaner, greener, and more sustainable than conventional cars. However, the EV industry has a dark side, as their batteries have limited lifespans of around 10 years or 150,000 miles. After this, they lose their capacity and performance, requiring replacement or recycling. The industry's latest buzzword, black mass, highlights the need for recycling and the potential for effective reuse of materials. Electric vehicles, EVs, rely on scarce and energy-intensive battery metals like lithium-ion, nickel, cobalt, and magnesium, which generate significant emissions and require extensive mining and processing. However, these metals take years to offset their carbon footprint, overlooking the importance of battery recycling. The industry's latest buzzword, black mass, emphasizes the need for a sustainable alternative. Black mass, the residual substance left after dismantling lithium-ion batteries, is a valuable resource that can be recycled repeatedly. Almost 99% of battery material are reused, but the challenge lies in practical recycling and repurposing of valuable cathode materials, which is more efficient than mining earth for these metals at over 90% efficiency rate. Recycling used electric car batteries is more efficient than mining the earth for metals, and recycling a pioneer in recovering valuable materials from the black mass, has developed a new approach that efficiently extracts cathode material from the black mass, repurposing them into precursor cathode materials PCAM, and lithium for battery manufacturing. This innovative process reduces the need for mining new materials and minimizes waste, making it a significant step forward in sustainable battery technology. Recyclico, a major battery supplier, has found that batteries made from recovered materials perform just as well as new ones. Independent testing showed that ion battery cells using Recyclico's high nickel PCAM N83 and N90 compositions were on par with freshly mined minerals. Recyclico now operates a demonstration facility in Vancouver, Canada, producing high-quality battery material for top industry brands. In a recent development, Recyclico announced a 25 million USD joint venture with Zenith Chemical Corporation to establish a lithium battery recycling plant in Taiwan. Zenith Chemical Corporation has partnered with Recyclico to rapidly expand large-scale production of lithium-ion batteries, marking the first of many commercial partnerships in the automotive industry's pursuits of electric vehicle lineups. Recyclico's lithium-ion battery recycling solution could be crucial for automakers and battery manufacturers to ensure a sustainable source of essential materials and metals for North America's electric future. Automakers like BMW, Ford, and Mercedes-Benz are exploring EV battery recycling opportunities through partnerships or joint ventures. Glencore plans to process black mass in Italy with Lifecycle, while BASF plans to produce it in Germany next year. Mercuria Energy Trading has agreed to form a joint venture with U.S. Recycler to sell its black mass worldwide. Green black mass can reduce environmental impact and ensure a more sustainable supply chain. Recycling materials are predicted to make up 15% of global lithium, nickel, and cobalt supplies by the end of this decade, according to S&P Global Commodity Insight. However, the black mass industry faces challenges like changing battery chemistry, which lacks valuable materials like nickel and cobalt, and lower value of LFP batteries, which may reduce profitability and require more energy and equipment to separate metals and phosphate. The lack of standardization and regulation in the recycling sector further complicates the comparison and verification of the quality and purity of black mass products. To overcome these challenges, the black mass industry needs to develop new technologies and methods for processing different types of batteries, create a transparent and reliable market for black mass trading, and harmonize regulations and standards across different regions. These steps can boost the confidence and competitiveness of the black mass industry. I respect continuing to wait until the finish line. For more videos about the most recent automotive news like this, please consider subscribing to Car Time.